Hey everyone, welcome to Dad's RC Workbench. Today we're gonna uh, open this package up. Got it just today. Uh, anxious, got it on eBay. Uh, this is a package I got from Little Guys Racing Parts. It's a company created from Jordan Pellegrino from U4 Racing, um, like uh, King of the Hammers, that kind of thing, and uh, Ultra Four. He uh, likes to uh, design and race the SEX24, and he created, uh, made his own tires. So ordered some. They were uh, $9.99 for two, and uh, so I got four, and I got uh, five dollars in shipping from uh, from a store on eBay. So let's open them up and check them out. Got these for my SEX24. Uh, or my uh, WPL um, kind of did some measurements and hopefully they'll work um, on both so let's uh, check them out look like they got good packaging um, and uh, looks like stuff you get out of the hobby store he said he uh, worked really hard on the uh, rubber compound so I'm anxious to see I can already feel that they're like super squishy i um, going to see how they fit on at least my WPL cuz I they're not the the tires aren't glued to the rims so let's uh let's open them up size of uh, a little bit bigger than 1.0 I think closer to 1.2 which I've been looking for for my uh, WPL uh, C24 um, something with a little bit better compound um, cuz I really like the uh, the uh, rock creepers on my uh, SEX24. So just putting this to the side, these are the RC four wheel drive rock creepers. Let me put that in focus there. And so here's a picture of the SEX24 with them. Model these after the tires that they run on their Jeep, I believe, uh, one to one Jeep. So it will definitely fit the uh, the wheel go in here but yeah definitely definitely a lot bigger than the uh, rock creepers in diameter which definitely will give it some more ground clearance and kind of a crazy aggressive uh, look to it so um, these are the uh, RC four-wheel drive bead locks and I um, already got these fitted properly so I'm not gonna mess with these um, just because they're really tedious to take on and off. I might unglue the uh, stock ones and put them on here, but um, let's uh, get my WPL C24 and let's match these up. Yeah, it's, it's more of a exact fit for this. So looks good on diameter. Let's, uh, let's look on did the measurements and looks good on like exactly on width too. So that's awesome. So I'm gonna take these uh, wheels and tires off and install these since I can just literally just pull them off because they're not glued or anything yet. And then um, I'll uh, I'll shoot some video on the rocks and uh, see how they do. I'm assuming they'll do really good. Forgot to mention the tire compound. Um, I mean, trying to get good light here, but I mean, I can. It's nice and soft and rubbery, and it's got a good tread pattern. You can see that. It's awesome. It's like sticky, like the uh, RC four wheel drive. Same like nice compound. And then, uh, yeah, these are the these are the kit WPL uh, tires, which are softer than the RTRs, I believe. Um, and there's a big difference between this and that. So I'm uh, anxious to see how these perform. Also, they come with their own foam, so that that's cool. Um, feels good. It's like a single stage foam, simple foam, but. Uh, you know, for 20 bucks for four and a $5 shipping fee, 
Really can't beat that. So let's get at it. Installing these. The new ones on there. So I'm gonna use the uh, their their foams front and back and try that out, and then uh, might switch out the hair bun on the back ones. Yeah, just took a just a smell of the, the it smells like real tire. Good good compound. All right. That looks pretty good for not gluing it on or anything. Definitely um some good squish. Let's see how this uh this does, it doesn't want to uh, reform after you squish it. You can probably vent these if you wanted to. See that? A perfect size for it. Nice scale look. It's like a it's going to be a lot of uh, a lot of deformation in the you know uh, shaping of the the uh, tire when you're on rocks and stuff because uh, the air can't get out or something. So all right, there we go. They look pretty good on the WPL C24 Tech One. Look, uh, scale. There we go. Nice. I mean, there these. This compound is awesome. I can't wait to get it out on the rocks. I'm gonna try it out on my rock pile in the backyard. Um, but definitely get out on the rocks where I go crawling with my uh, tent scale and uh, see how they work.